Alright, so now we are back in the Castle Tall Market. And for this little mini game, we're going to need about 30 rupees, which I went ahead and grabbed a few. Uh, you don't really need to grab any more because you're going to get a big payout at the end. So Go up to the Happy Mouse Salesman. She's going to, he, she, whatever it is, is going to talk to you about the trading game. You want to be a happiness salesman. But pretty much, we have four masks to sell, and then we can buy... Well, you don't really get to buy it. You get to rent out the other one. So we're going to borrow the Keaton mask. Now, it doesn't cost you anything to uh, borrow it. But you need a few rupees just so you can cover the cost of anything in case somebody, you know decides not to pay you the full amount, which there is one, and it's kind of annoying. First one's the Keaton Mask, and the Keaton Mask is sold to the guard at the Kekriko Village. If you remember, he was talking about his son wanted the Keaton Key Something Mask. Well, that's this mask. So we're going to make our way to the Kekriko Village and talk to him. Uh, the Keaton Mask is big in... It's not really big in the Majora's Mask. Uh, Kefi wears it most of the game. Once you get it from him, uh, it really only has, like, one use. use. It helps you get a heart piece. So you can go the whole game without even seeing it. I'm actually going to do a Majora's Mask walkthrough when I get through with this. It might take me a little longer, because I've got school and everything like that. But I'll try to get it done for you guys. So, we will come over here, put on the mask, and then talk to the guy, and he will buy it from you. Apparently he's very, very popular. He's going to give you a 5, pro five rupee profit. So now what we're going to do is we're going to go back to the Happy Mask shop. So I'm going to go ahead and skip ahead. Alright, so we're back in the Happy Mask Salesman shop. And we're going to pay back 10 rupees because that's what we sold the mask for. And we're going to get the next one, which is the Skull Mask. The Skull Mask belongs, or it doesn't belong, belongs to this, the Happy Mask Salesman. The Skull Mask goes to the Skull Kid in the Lost Woods. So I'm going to go ahead and skip ahead to that point real fast. Alright, now before we give the Skull Kid this mask, what we're going to do is we're going to go claim something first. We're going to go to the right, then to the left, then to the right again, and then the left twice. And this is the only time you can do this one, so you want to do it as quick as possible. Wait, I went the wrong way. I think I went right too many times. Hold on. I did not go the right way. Hold on, let me try this again. Alright, go back in there. Okay, we're going to go to the right. And we're going to go to the left. Go to the right again. And go to the left again. And we'll go to the right. Okay, yeah, I was in the right spot. I forgot. There's a, a hole we need to fall down in. And if you head for these butterflies, that's where he is. It's around here somewhere. Just move around until you find it. And then put the skull, skull mask on. And these little Deku scrubs will pop up.
I don't exactly know what you're supposed to do there. I just ran around. But you'll do that, and then you will head back up. So then we'll go talk to the Skull Kid while you're wearing the mask. He'll buy it from you, but he is a cheapskate. He only gives you like 10 rupees for it or something. And he gives you 10, so you, you're you down 5 rupees, but that's alright. So now we're going to head back to the mask shop, so I will see you there. Alright, so we're back in the Happy Mask shop. We're going to get the next mask. This is the Spooky Mask. And this one goes to the little kid inside the graveyard. The one that was telling you not to mess with the graves. So, I'll meet you at the graveyard. Alright, now we're in the graveyard, and the little kid is the one who you take the mask to so talk to him and he's going to pay you 30 rupees so then we're going to go back to the mask shop and get the last mask alright we're back at the mask shop and now we ha have the fourth and final mask that we need to trade and we're going to borrow the bunny hood Hopefully you've been following the walkthrough and you have the giant wallet because if not, you're not going to get the full benefit of this. The uh, full benefit is he's going to pay you more money than you can hold, so you're going to be able to, you know, fit 500 rupees in your wallet. For this one, you want to have the mask ready and your ocarina ready as well. I'll go ahead and put the bunny hood on. It doesn't do anything special like it does with the Majora's Mask. In Majora's Mask, it allows you to run a whole lot faster. But that's alright. Usually, he's running around the ranch. And you can always catch him by running counterclockwise. No, scratch that. Clockwise around the ranch, I believe. And he'll run until sundown. Fortunately, it's already getting close to sundown, so... Hopefully we can find him. There he is. See him in the little speck right there. And you can't talk to him until he stops, so... I'm gonna try playing the Sun Song. Maybe he runs at night, I can't remember. Oh, he does run until sundown. Cause he was stopped. Whoops. He should stop moving here pretty soon. There we go. Once he stops, you'll talk to him. He talks about wanting the mask. He's going to pay you a crazy amount of money. And then we'll head back to the mask shop. And as you can see, we now have 500 rupees. Alright, now back at the Happy Mask Shop, you'll talk to this guy, and he will give you'll give him 50 rupees for the bunny hood. 
and now he's gonna let you choose from four I believe four other masks well he's gonna give you the mask of truth lend it to you whatever and there's really only one use for that and we're gonna get to it right now well there's another one if you uh, wear it while you're talking to people it'll show what they really think so I'm not gonna worry about the other mask you can borrow because there's really no point so for this we need to go back to the Lost Woods so I will meet you there alright so back to the Lost Woods we're gonna do the same thing we did earlier we're gonna take a right then take a left take a right and then two lefts and then we're gonna fall into the same hole we did earlier And once again, put on the Mask of Truth. And he will talk about something else. I think you have to go up and speak to him. He's going to give you a chance to carry more Deaconuts. Alright, that's all that we have time for. So I will pick this back up. And I'll pick it up right here.